But yeah, if anything, I just want to talk to y'all today real quick. I'm running my mouth. This ain't no show video. I ain't got nothing to show y'all today. I will be reviewing some hats and shit from um, Apparel Trap or Trap Apparel. Either way, that's how this shit goes. So y'all stay tuned for that because y'all know I got to keep a hat on my shit. I'm going bald. Um, anyway, though, man, if anything, though, bro, like it just killed me and stuff like how how grimy and shit people can really be, bro. You feel what I'm saying? Like, so, I basically know a DL man and whatever, and the man is salty at me because I don't want to go with him. And this is why I don't like DL dudes because they weird as fuck to me. You feel what I'm saying? How are you a DL but you want a relationship? How you a DL but you want to go out and shit and do faggot shit? I'm really it's not no relationship type jump off from the jump. I always state that. You feel me? If I like you on the relationship side, like you gonna know. Like I'm cuffing you. I ain't going nowhere. I ain't going nowhere. You feel what I'm saying? Like don't even let me come over your house. You feel what I'm saying? Like, <laughs> cause I ain't going nowhere, bro. <laughs> no, nah, but for real though, bro. So it's just like, I just don't like stuff like that. You feel what I'm saying? How can you even? How can you even trust a DL person? You feel what I'm saying? Them niggas be everywhere. They all over the place. Like I said, bro, like, they DL, bro. If they lying about who the fuck they is and they every day, like, they gonna lie to you every single day of, that, uh, of your life or whatever the fuck. You feel what I'm saying? Like, that shit just dead to me. I just don't like stuff like that. You feel what I'm saying? Like, if I'm gonna fuck with anybody, bro, it's gonna be an equal situation. We both know who he is. We both down for the situation. It ain't no one-sided situation. Ain't nobody trying to be in control because in all reality, even when these people buying gifts and looking out and they claim they just being nice and shit, you feel what I'm saying? Them bitches is expecting something in return and I'm really starting to learn this now. Like, And it's like, bro, I don't owe you shit though. No matter what they expect, I don't owe you shit, bro. You feel what I'm saying? When we signed up for whatever the fuck we signed up for, this did not say this, bitch. So it's just like, no, bro, I don't be feeling it. I don't like people like that. I stay away from people like that because it's all some weird ass shit, bro. I don't fuck with that fake ass flow shit. Like, if it ain't going, if that shit don't make no sense, it don't make no sense. It ain't right. If it don't even feel right, it ain't right, bro. I'm not about to half ass with no nigga, like, this nigga want me to be in a fake ass relationship or something like what you want me to do, bro? Say I talk to you and spend your fucking money. I don't like you, bro. You should be happy that I'm being honest with your bitch ass. I could say that I'm with you and all type of shit every day, bitch. And just use the fuck out you. But who the fuck does that? I don't even want to fucking use you, bro. Talking about some I can do so much better. I've been playing myself every day with you. I'm so hurt. Bro, you are a real life faggot, bro. I feel so bad for you calling yourself even a DL man. You're not DL, bro. You're clearly a faggot, and you don't have nobody to love. And it's sad. I feel bad for you, bro. I really, really do, bro. And the thing is, once you stop paying for people, then you'll get you some real love. People will be attracted to you for you and not because of your money and shit, bro. You throwing gifts and shit, bitch, that's not going to get you nowhere neither, bro. I'm sorry, bro. I'm tired of the bullshit, bro. Don't come at me with that fuck shit. Think I owe your ass nothing. You ain't getting shit from me, bro. But a motherfucking conversation and what the fuck we been doing. Other than that, I can't do the extra shit. I'm sorry. It's just not for me. On no day. And I don't deal with no fuck like this or to make them do shit like this. But I don't owe you shit. You feel what I'm saying? Period. Like. This for anybody that be acting like I owe their ass something. I will get the name and bitches and they'll be sorry because they watch my YouTube videos. You feel what I'm saying? I don't owe nobody nothing, bro. And I'm tired of hoes feeling like I'm obligated and all type of crazy shit. I'm not obligated to do shit but live my life, bro. If you feel like because you looked out for me, I owe you my motherfucking self and every the fuck thing else, don't look out for me. Don't call me. Don't bother me, bro. Find the next man and take care of their ass or something. Look out for them. Send them the couple $10 and the little shit that you be giving and shit. Because that shit ain't shit, bro. I don't know why niggas be feeling like they be doing something, bro. This this little shit that niggas be doing when you got to live an everyday life for real, for real. Stop playing with me, man. That shit is just not, it don't make no sense, bro. It's very fucking comical to me, bro. 
I can't take it, bro. And that's just not my life, so. Stop bringing me the bullshit. Because I don't feel bad. I don't feel sorry. Ten years from now, I'm still not going to feel bad. I'm still not going to like you. And all I'm saying is, if you a DL, man, get your shit together, bro. Don't nobody want to talk to no fraud-ass nigga, bro. If you say you doing this and you doing that, please be doing this and doing that. Because once niggas find out you out here, bro, you not a DL nigga no more. Once you fuck with too many gay niggas, you not a DL nigga no more. Once you go on the gay club, you not a DL nigga no more. On a fucking date out to eat with a nigga yeah it would be cool if y'all was real life buddies but in all reality y'all really gay niggas so bruh you not that dl bro i'm just saying like stop playing crazy you want to kiss me all in my mouth and shit you a faggot bro i don't even kiss niggas bro no disrespect to people that be kissing and stuff you know whatever that's for people that's in love that man say he dl and he on jacked I just really don't believe that they even DL like that no more. Like, you on Jack, bro. Five niggas know you on here, bro. No matter how DL you think you is, bro, five gay niggas know you now. So you're not that DL. You feel what I'm saying? Get out of here, bro. If you DL and you in niggas DMs and shit, bro, you not a fucking... What is you doing in the nigga DM if... I mean, if... I, I mean, if you not gay... <laughs> What is you doing in the nigga DM, bro? These DL niggas is really confused these days, bro. I really think that they think they really be straight, bro. You not straight, bro. These, some of these niggas be gayer than the next man. Oh, God, bro. And they just so scared to live out their life, bro. And I swear to God, bro. That's why some of them hate. That's why some of them hate how we live. You feel me? They talk down. They say that. Niggas do too much. Oh, they can't believe we do this, that, and the third. But them bitches really be wishing they could do all of this shit for real, for real. Them bitches want to be in the gay clubs. Them bitches want to be whatever the fuck. Them bitches want to be that nigga on Instagram getting a whole bunch of likes with his motherfucking dick out and all type of shit. But they simply can't. You feel what I'm saying? And that's why the fuck them niggas be talking that dumb shit, bro. Some of these niggas don't even be having nothing to even be capable of doing any of that stuff. You feel what I'm saying? And that's why them bitches be hating, bro. That's why they be talking down. They say they DL to make themselves feel superior. But them niggas really bitches, bro. Them niggas scared of life, bro. Them niggas scared of who the fuck they is for real, for real, bro. You think I would want to be that? I'd rather be who the fuck I am, bro, every single day, bro. I ain't confused nor lost, but these niggas is, though. Got me fucked up, bro. Y'all make sure y'all subscribe to my channel. Y'all stay tuned. I, like I said, I got heavy new little videos coming out and shit. Just I'm coming with the, with the videos all the time now because I'm done with Instagram and shit like that. I can't even talk on there. Them bitches that never even really understand or relate. Them bitches living in Instagram lives every single day. Sometimes you just got to take a break from that shit because we live in a real fucking world. You feel what I'm saying? And all that other good shit. So, yeah, y'all stay tuned subscribe to my channel if y'all not subscribed to my channel and definitely follow me on ig at tay that tatted just so y'all can see my pictures and shit you feel me and yeah man that's that thank y'all for watching